build it right here. Yep. Alright, so what you need to do is position yourself away from the water, slide this way. Yep, and then don't forget you need to be on that side of it. Okay, and you need to reach over and grab the handle that's on this side. This plastic, this um, nylon handle, yep. Pull it over, leverage, yep. And what you're trying to do is get that metal latch down into the hole. Can you do it? Keep pushing, go, go, go. Nice. Oh, you're close. You're close. You got it. Try one more time. Right. If you can do this on your own, this is huge. Yep, you got that. Slide, lean it over, you got that. Oh Hit. my god, it's not going in. Alright, I'll do it. Alright, All right, nose down. Pull that back till you're good. Yeah, man, you ready? Yeah. Maiden voyage, my friend. Yep. How you feeling? Good. Excited? Yes. You're good here, right? No. I don't need to worry about anything. I'm not gonna find you downstream. No. Good. All right, can you get out on your own or do you need me to push you out? Um. Use the paddle behind you. If you need to, push behind a little bit. There you go. Yep, spin those around. You're backwards on you. Yep, there you go. What do you think so far? Awesome. It's gonna be good, right? Yeah. All right, you ready for an adventure? Yes. Right, let's figure this stuff out. So no water inside, right? Okay. Everything's holding up nicely. Yeah. Pretty easy to get in and out of so far. I mean, that wasn't too big of a challenge, but yeah. feels pretty stable, right? Yeah, very stable. I think this is gonna work out well. Actually, for me, it's gonna be nice. I can keep my dry bag literally right here. It's got all my supplies and my legs fit just about perfect. Just nice over there. Found a way to mount my GoPro up, which is kind of cool, and that looks like it's gonna be pretty secure, so that's cool footage there. And uh, got all my gear behind me. Bran, you got a dry bag and your life ja jacket and all that good stuff? Yeah. All right. All right, so let's uh, find our way up river.
right, so far, what do you think? It's great. Really good? Yes, it works fantastic. Nice. Uh, opens up a whole new sort yeah. of ability, right? Yeah, it's awesome. How's it tracking? Very well. Is it comfortable? Yes. Good. Tuck Tech stickers will probably eventually completely fall off, but in the meantime, we'll try to keep them on here. Be nice to cut some custom outer limitless vinyl for this, but we'll see. It's a little bit hard where it's the plastic material. Things don't want to stick to this very well. And of course you have the folds to contend with. But um, yeah, so far, these things are pretty sweet. I gotta say, uh, I am very happy with this experience. And much, much more to come. What I like about this kayak is that it has a lot of room. It's super wide, so if I had like anything next to me, I wouldn't be like crammed up against my legs, but it'd actually have like room. It wouldn't be tight against them, which is something I'm really looking forward to because I like fishing a lot. I have all the stuff I need. It can be right next to me without cramming against my legs. So we've been out here about an hour, and I gotta say, one thing I have not thought of, but it's true, I have not yet said to myself, I wish I was more comfortable. The seat is pretty good. I mean, it's not perfect, uh, but the overall ability to adjust it is not bad. And I mean, cushion-wise, not bad at all. So I mean, comfort, I'm pretty good. Brand, what do you think? I think it's really good. I feel very comfortable and secure in the seat. Yep. I don't think... I mean, it doesn't need much more on the way yeah, of padding, you think? Yeah, it doesn't need much more. Nice. Leaning back, not bad. Yeah. Have you had to adjust it at all? No. No? Adjust it once and you're good? Yeah. I gave mine just a little bit of a tweak. So just reaching down and snugging it up just a little bit. I mean, I feel like I was leaning back for a bulk of the time. And at this point, I want to sit up a little more. Just yeah. tighten up on the strap just a tiny bit. Very easy to adjust on the fly, which is nice. And uh, yeah, I mean, it's, it's doing its job. Tuck tuck man. Yeah. Th they got it dialed in, huh?
You backing it in? Success! Uh -oh. He made it. You have to get it. So. All right, final thoughts. What do you think? They were really good. Good? Yes. Good experience? Yes. Uh, is there anything you would change? Not, not, not that I know of right now. Not much, right? Yeah. Uh, pretty well dialed in, feeling good about it? Yes. Nice. It felt very comfortable, very easy to maneuver, just really good overall. Good. For me, I would say definitely positive experience, very good, easy to maneuver, very easy to transport, no problem there. It takes a little bit of practice to get everything folded up, put it away, but again, not a big deal. That will come through time, additional practice. Generally speaking, in terms of the setup, I have to say the setup was pretty easy. It's stiff, so if you're not somebody that's strong enough to get the latches, that might be a little bit difficult. And I think there could be some minor modifications to sort of help things out in terms of the latch. Part of the problem is when you're working the latch, it actually, your, your hands are kind of in the way. And you almost do get pinched when you're trying to get the latch down and the little mechanism over. But not a big deal. It's definitely something you can work with. Durability, can't speak to that yet. We'll have to see. Time will tell. But in terms of portability, fantastic. Tracking, awesome. Comfort, generally good. And from what I can tell, durable enough at least for today. And so, all right, guys, I hope you enjoyed that. A two-part series on the Tuck Tech Kayaks. Now, all in all, fantastic. Absolutely awesome performance, all things considered. Not exactly perfect, nor would I necessarily expect it to be. For something that's so lightweight, so portable, overall incredible capability, the ease of getting the kayaks to your destination, the for the most part ease of setting them up with some caveats, but all in all, a fantastic option. I mean, really, really great performance. We've absolutely loved these. This is just the start of our adventures. So I do have to say, of all things, I can absolutely recommend these. And so just a few things worth considering. Of course, a great lightweight option, but there are the pros and the cons, the trade-offs that come with that. It's not going to be quite as refined as a full-sized kayak. So in other words, the edges just a little bit sharp. You saw that I sanded them down. I would definitely recommend that. I think the latch could use a little bit of a redesign, not necessarily. I mean, it definitely works. It performs its function, but if they were able to kind of change the way that mechanism worked, I think it would be easier. And especially for people who aren't quite as strong. Over time, I'll be very curious to see how this breaks in. I hope over time it gets easier and easier to assemble. I really do need to get to the point where my son or my wife could set this up. I think at this point, it's a little bit difficult for them, but we'll figure that out over time. And then the last thing, what about the long-term durability? The nice thing with Tuck Tech, made in the USA, great customer service, and bottom line is they have a three-year warranty. So I'm hoping that this will hold up, but again, time will tell. And so again, guys, there you go, the Tuck Tech Kayaks, the 2023 edition. I hope you enjoyed that. To the people at Tuck Tech, thank you very much. And for the rest of you, if you like this content, do me a favor. Take a look at my Outer Limitless 2 channel, which is more on the tactical and firearm side of things. At this point, that channel's growing quickly. I have a ton of videos up there. So if you like what you see here on Outer Limitless, do me a favor and check me out on Outer Limitless 2. So, all right, guys, thanks for stopping by. I hope you like what you saw. I hope you found it a little bit informative. If you like what you saw, please like, share, and subscribe. And as always, thanks for stopping by. Take care now. We'll see you soon.